You guys, I looked everywhere and I can't find my elf today. Oh, he's hiding so well lately, I can't even find him. Ta -da -da, ta -da -da. Hey, Isabella, Isabella. Hey, hi, Mirabelle. What are you doing? Um, I think I'm gonna go shopping. I haven't gone shopping for Christmas. Oh, did you see the elf today? Uh, I gave up. I couldn't find him yesterday or the day before, so I just gave up. I'm not gonna give up. I'm not gonna give up, and I'm gonna find him. Um, yeah, Antonio's really good at finding the elf lately. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go by the Christmas tree, and I'm gonna find that elf. Oh, good luck. I'm gonna go shopping. You wanna come? Maybe, maybe tomorrow. Okay, sounds good. Have fun finding the elf on the shelf. Oh, he should definitely be here somewhere around the Christmas tree. Do you guys see him? Uh, oh, Elf, where are you? I don't see him anywhere. Oh, I don't see him, just the angel. Did you see anything? You did? What did you see? Where, 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 where? What? I don't see him. I just don't see him. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Oh! I don't see the elf. You know what? I'm just gonna go back to the kitchen and make something to eat. Maybe I can find him in the kitchen. Maybe. Yeah, he wasn't by the Christmas tree. Ah, I'm so tired. Even my glasses are upside down. I looked for this elf everywhere. You know what? I'm just gonna go upstairs. I'm gonna go and relax a little bit. Hey, 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 what was that? Did you guys hear something? What was that? And what is this? Who put this here? Did you see? You didn't? playing jokes on me. This is the Madrigal family surprises. Play out the story of Disney and Canto with the entire Madrigal family. <gasps> Includes 14 figures and 13 accessories. <gasps> Guys, this is awesome. I, it looks to me like a, uh, an advent calendar. Do you guys want to open it with me? You do? Awesome. Let's see what's inside. So let's open up our 24 days of surprises, guys. And it looks like we have uh, Louisa, we have Mirabelle, um, we have um, guess who figure, I would say this is Antonio, and I would say this is Dolores. What do you guys think? She looks like she's listening to something. So let's open up our calendar and see all the amazing surprises. Oh, wow, look at this, guys. This is the wall from Encanto, and this is Mirabelle's door. And we are gonna open one by one. Woo, so many surprises. Are you guys ready? All right, let's go to number one. And let's see who's hiding behind this picture. Oh, and it looks like it's Mariano. Mariano is a family friend. It's Isabella's fiance and Dolores' boyfriend. Oh, and here he is reading a book and getting all smart and he has a bandage on his nose. Very, very cute. And let's go to number two. So I see our number two is right here. This is Dolores. And let's see who we have. Oh my goodness. And there she is. She looks like she's a baby Dolores though. And here's our beautiful Dolores. And if you know something special about her dress, she actually has wave sounds here because she listens to everything and she can hear everything. Very cute. And here is your boyfriend. <laughs> All right, let's move on to number three. Number three is right here. Number three is Abuela. Abuela Alma. And let's see what do we have. Oh, how cute, guys. We have 
from you, Rabella. So thank you, girl. She is so adorable. Let's take her out. Oh, so cute. Let's move on to number four. And number four is right here. And this is Augustine and Julieta. And they are the parents of Mirabelle, Isabella, and um, Louisa. And let's see, what do we have? Oh, we have Augustine here. And let's see what happened. Oh, he looks like he's hurt. Oh no, guys, look at this. He has a lot of bites on his face and his hands. Oh, I wonder why these bumblebees are buzzing him. Okay, let's take out the bumblebees. And should we put them around him? Oh, no, 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 shoo away. <laughs> We're just going to put them around him real quick, just like this. Oh, so cute. Buzz, buzz, bumblebee. Oh, no. And he feels just like this. Okay. Oh, so cute. Oh, shoo away, bumblebees. Shoo away. I don't like you. <laughs> oh, poor Augustine. Okay, so let's go on to number five. Number five is, is right here, and this is Julieta. And let's see, what do we have inside? Oh, yeah. That's what we have. She's such an amazing woman. She can heal anybody with her magical food. So let's move on to number six. Number six is up here. And let's see what do we have inside number six. Hmm, this is something amazing. What is this, guys? So it looks like we got a table with a bowl of food and a book. So let's put them nicely together, just like this. And like this. Hmm, we got some delicious food. Okay, and then we got the bowl with the steamy soup. And the book. Let's move on to number seven. Where can number seven be? Here she is, and it's Mirabelle, guys. Mirabelle. Looks like we got Mirabelle in her sewing machine. She's ready to make a new dress. Let's take her out and put Okay, let's get out all the tiny pieces. Okay. Excellent. And now, let's see, I've never built a sewing machine. And we're just going to click them together, just like this. Perfect. And then this goes on this side. And just like this, her sewing machine is ready. Here we are, Mirabelle. You're ready to sew something if you wish to. All right, let's go to number eight. We have Mirabelle again. And let's see what do we have inside here. We have a cute gift box and a chalkboard. Oh, how cute. This can be a wonderful gift for anyone who wants an animal. Here we are. We can put the jack right in the box. And we have the sun and some butterflies on the box. How beautiful is that? All right, guys. Let's move on to number nine. And I see Antonio. I wonder if this is Antonio in here. Let's see. <gasps> no, it's not. Yes, it is. This is Antonio. Okay, Antonio. Antonio is such a cute little boy. I love him. Okay, let's move on to number 10. Do you guys see number 10? I don't see it. And here's number 10. And that's the beautiful room that Antonio has. So let's see who's inside. Oh, and we have another chocolate and the pecan. 
Mr. Antonio's friends. Oh, Antonio, we got your friends. Don't worry. Here they are. They're part of the family. And let's move on to number 11. Do you guys see number 11? I see it. And it's a beautiful picture of the magical home. And let's open. Oh, and we got Peppa. Oh, how cute. I love her. There is Peppa. She looks really happy. No clouds, no rain today. She looks amazing. Okay, sit here right next to your sister. And let's move on to number 12. Do you guys see number 12? I see it too. And who is that? That's Felix. Let's see what do we have inside there. Oh, oh. oh how cute. Let's put this beautiful rainbow together for Papa. Oh, she loves the sun and the rainbow. No clouds in the sky today. Okay, and just like this, we're going to put it here. Oh, like this. Perfect. Okay, and then we're going to attach the rainbow on top. And there you are, my dear. Oh, there we are. There she is. So beautiful. Wow, oh, guys, this looks amazing so far. Everybody is so busy with their animals, sewing, cooking, being buzzed by the bees, buzz, buzz, and making some beautiful rainbow. So let's move on to number 13. Do you guys see it? Oh, I see it up there, all the way on top. And it looks like that's Isabella. Isabella is so beautiful. She has all colors. So let's see what we have. Oh, there we are. We have Isabella in her beautiful, beautiful dress. It represents the fact that she is not perfect. Even though everybody thinks she's perfect, Isabella is not a perfect girl. Let's move on to number 14. Do you guys see number 14? I don't see it. Oh, there it is. And again, it's beautiful Isabella with her beautiful flowers. Let's see what we have inside. I think these are beautiful flowers for Isabella. And so we're just going to put them together and put Isabella in the middle of them. Okay, and there we are. Such a beautiful display of flowers for Isabella, the flower girl. She's so pretty in there. Okay, let's move on to number 15. Do you guys see number 15? I think I see it, and it's Camillo. Let's see, what do we have inside here? I think we have Camilo. He's such a goofy boy. And here he is with his bright, silly smile. <laughs> so cute. Hey, Antonio, where are you? <laughs> All right, guys, let's go to number 16. Do you guys see number 16? I think I spy number 16 right over here. And this is Peppa. Let's see what we have inside here. Oh, and this is Peppa's husband, Felix. There he is. Oh, but wait a minute, he has no legs. Hmm. What can we do about that? Oh, there we are. We can do this, guys. Here. Hey, give me back my legs. <laughs> okay, son. I guess we can share them. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so we're just gonna put them on just like this. And there is Felix. He is a very, very handsome man. Okay. 
Oh guys, we're getting so many characters. Look at this, I just love it. Okay, let's move on to number 17. Do you guys spy number 17? I spy number 17 right here. And we have Louisa. I was wondering where Louisa is. She's actually one of my favorite characters. Okay, Louisa. Oh, she's so pretty. Look at this. Oh, so cute. Okay, let's come out. And let's sit next to your sisters, Louisa. I just love Louisa. What's one thing that you love about Louisa? Let me know. Okay, let's go with your sisters right here. Let's go to number 18. And again, we have Mirabelle. But we have a donkey. <laughs> I think I can tell who this belongs to. Guess who this belongs to? <laughs> hey, if you guess Louisa, you're right. She's the strongest in the family and has a tint right here, which we can put it right just like that. Oh, how cute. Oh, this is so adorable, guys. Wow, amazing. All right, let's go to number 19. And number 19 is up here and it's the tower of the casita. And if you guys know somebody lives in the tower, can you tell me who? Yes, it's Bruno. And let's see what Bruno's doing today. I think he's playing with his friends. Oh no, he's actually feeding a rat. He's giving them some cheese. Oh, so cute. This is adorable. Let's move on to number 20. Number 20 is up here. And again, it's Bruno. So let's see what's inside. Something that we have to put together. So let's see what it is. So I would say it's the actual door Bruno goes through. And he most of the time watches his family because he doesn't come out. So let's see. Yeah, that I was right. This is his door. And then this is just a stand right here like that how cute is this and on top of this we have some tiny little rats that we're gonna put over here on top they're watching bruno look at this there we are perfect let's move on to number 21 where is number 21 and it's right here and again it's mirabelle Let's see what Mirabelle has in here. Oh, guys, this is the, um, if you remember when Mirabelle was running and was trying to um, find the green stone so she could actually discover her gift and Bruno could tell her future, this is the green stone that she had and this is what Bruno uses to tell her um, future. Just like this, we put it together. The tiny little stone belongs in the front. And just like this, um, I believe in... All right, now we're moving on to number 22. And it's over here. And this is Pedro. This is um, the grandfather. So let's see who we have over here. Oh, we have Abuela. Of course, we have Abuela and her candle. Abuela is such an amazing and strong woman that keeps the entire family together. Wow, this is so pretty. Well, hi, Abuela. Here, you belong right in here. Wow, you guys, so many amazing surprises. This is so beautiful, amazing. Let's move on to number 23. 23 is right here and it's a picture of the Madrigal family. So let's see who we have inside. Oh, what a beautiful tree of the entire family. Okay, 
guys, let's put it together just like this and on the bottom just like this. Perfect. And now we're going to need to put the sticker on the front. Here we are, we put the sticker and here we have um, Abuela and Pedro, which are the family. Together they have three children and six grandchildren. This is so beautiful. We can actually put it right here behind. And now we have number 24, guys. And number 24 is Mirabelle's door. So I wonder what's inside Mirabelle's door. So let's go and see what magical thing do we have inside here. Oh guys, this is Mirabelle and her casita. Oh, I love this. This is so pretty. Let's put it together. Oh, I love, love, love this. Okay, so we can put it right in here, just like that. And so we got our green sticker of the family, and we put it right here on the door. And there's Mirabelle. And there she is. Oh, guys, this is so amazing and so magical. Do you agree? This is so beautiful. Oh, this, this is absolutely magical, magical. I have my entire family here and they're so tiny that I can't even play with them. This is so awesome. Hey guys, please, please, please don't forget to subscribe. And if you see the elf, which I don't. Please don't forget to hit the like button and I'll see you guys next time. Mwah! Hugs and kisses. Bye.